Welcome back and joining me this morning, Katie Tidwell and Monica Meyer of the Three Hearts Foundation are here with us and they're going to talk a little bit about their gala coming up in February. So Katie, let's talk a little bit about what exactly is the Three Hearts Foundation? So Three Hearts Foundation is a nonprofit organization that my husband and I started um, here in the state of Missouri. It um, revolves all around infertility, all aspects of infertility. So we um, advocate for couples who are going through infertility. Um, we try the best we can to support them mm -hmm. um, because I know when we went through infertility personally, we felt very alone. Mm -hmm. We felt like we didn't know anybody who had gone through infertility or IVF specifically. Um, so we didn't really have a good support system other than you know our family and friends who supported us as the best they could, which mm -hmm. was still amazing. Um, but we spread awareness. We also, a big part of our foundation is that we raise money so we can give IVF grants to mm -hmm. couples each year to help them through that difficult part of their journey, which is paying for treatments. Mm -hmm. I could imagine yes. that that is so beneficial because a lot of people who are going through those treatments, they talk about the cost yes. and you know, that is something that probably hinders people sometime yes. from being able to go through those treatments. And so that brings me to my next question. Why are you guys holding this gala? Is it to raise those funds for those families? Yeah, absolutely. So this is one of our biggest events of the year mm -hmm. um, and we are doing this to raise that, those funds so that we can give that grant to a family, which is always our goal, to be able yeah. to give that to one family each year. So um, this is kind of our big event to be able to do that, but also present that um, that winning grant to, yeah. to the family. So it is a surprise to them oh, wow. at the event. It's a surprise to all of our guests. Mm -hmm. And so it's a very um, exciting, emotional uh, time for everybody that's that's yeah. there. So it's, it's a wonderful event. I bet that that's just a beautiful moment yeah. in the whole event that people probably really look forward to mm -hmm. and to know that you know the money that they are giving to the foundation is going to something that is so important and it's so meaningful to them absolutely yes. that, we want people yeah. to feel um, a part of being able to help someone have a family mm -hmm. you know having a family yeah. isn't easy for everyone right and it, it's amazing how many people in our community are affected by this mm -hmm. and so to be able to create an event where people can come and give their part that that they know that they've impacted that family or families multiple um, the best that they can. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And so Katie, I know that you and your husband are the founders of yes. this foundation. Monica, what's kind of your role in the foundation and the event? Sure, absolutely. I'm a um, big support to Katie, uh -huh. um, whatever she needs. <laughs> um, but I am technically one of the board members, mm -hmm. so I am the treasurer. Um, but we do have a, a board of seven mm -hmm. trustees. So um, we're kind of a big group, we're yeah. a big team, and we all put our heads together and work very hard to um, create this event and mm -hmm. also to support this foundation. Yeah, and for both of you, just really why is this so important for you guys both? Yeah. So, you know, when we were going through infertility, I I know we walked into it, they, it's that awkward moment at your clinic. You feel like you've hit the end of the road mm -hmm. when it comes down to having to do IVF. Because you feel like you have already exhausted all other options mm -hmm. And there's just, it's a roadblock. It's this mm -hmm. or nothing, and it's not even a guarantee. So really, when you're spending all this money to go through IVF, it is not even 100% guaranteed. And depending, it's case by case, depending on what your medical history is, it could go from 60% to 50% to 40%, 20% chance of working. Mm -hmm. And so that makes this even more important because when you're talking about spending this money on a huge maybe, yeah. it's devastating. So all that financial stress just adds on to the emotional, physical, mental, Mm -hmm. um, you know, stress that you're going through anyway. Yeah, I, so. I could totally imagine that, and this yeah. has to be so helpful. And so, Monica, why is it so important for you? Sure, I um, my journey is probably a little different mm -hmm. than than a lot of, of people. Everybody's journey is different, yeah. but um, mine is a little bit different. And so, for me, we were able to successfully have a family mm -hmm. after a lot of trials mm -hmm. uh, to get there, but for me it's a lot of being able to create an environment for people yeah. to be able to support mm -hmm. um, whether they need to have the support or whether there's a family member out there that doesn't know how mm -hmm. to support someone yeah. that they love. Mm -hmm. So for me it's creating that environment 
um, where we can come together. They can be quiet about mm -hmm. their journey if they want, or if they want to speak up about it, they now have a safe place to do that. Yeah, that's yeah. beautiful. And so the event is sold out, which is yes. amazing yes. for you all. Yes. That is yes. such great news. But how can people find out more information about the foundation? Say that they are seeking um, some support or they just want to get involved. How can they find that out? So our website, threeheartsfoundation.com, you can go on there. We always post upcoming events. Mm -hmm. You can follow us on social media. Um, we we do other events throughout the year that are fundraising. This is mm -hmm. just our big one. Um, but we do have a walk every May, and that's a big chance to come out and just support others, yeah. um, support the people that you love that are going through that, support you know, just because you want to, because right. you love the cause um, for whatever reason. So that it's a little bit more of a casual event versus mm -hmm. dressing up for a gala. So that is another way that you can join in, mm -hmm. volunteer. We love, we meet people at that event every single year that want to become a part of it. Yeah. So coming to that is really like step one. Mm -hmm. Or just reaching out to us on our website, email. We're all available yeah. on yeah. social media. And Reach we are out. very, Wonderful. we love for everyone to yes. come in. We love new faces. We. The support has just blown up in the last mm -hmm. few years, and we are just so grateful for yeah, that. That is so amazing. Well, ladies, thank you so much for joining me on yeah. The Breakfast Show, too, to talk about just how important the Three Hearts Foundation is to the community. If you want to learn more, definitely head on over to their website to find all about them. We'll be back in just a bit.